sports, work, school, or just life in general. We all need a place to unwind and relax after a long day. And that looks a little different for everybody. But sometimes these special havens need a little TLC to catch up with modern gaming trends. And that's where we come in. This is IGN's Battle Station. Presented by Samsung SSD, essential for gaming. Today's Battle Station upgrade comes courtesy of the Samsung 990 Pro Gen 4 NVMe SSD. Enjoy read and write speeds of up to 7,450 and 6,900 megabytes per second, respectively, with the Samsung 990 Pro. Better performance, less power. Users will see 50% improved performance per watt over the 980 Pro with optimal power efficiency with near max PCIe 4.0 performance, allowing for the ultimate gaming experience. Let's all meet David Navarro. Hi, my name is uh, David Navarro and I'm 22 years old. I'm from Los Angeles, California. Uh, I recently graduated college. I went to UC Riverside. I'm also trying to create content and be the best I can. We sent our camera crew to David's home in Los Angeles to get the lay of the land and see what we could do to up his game. So with winning this new battle station, I think it's the upgrade that I desperately needed. Um, first of all, we got a PS4. It's been with me for about five years now and it's pretty much on its last leg. Streaming on PS4 or any console is a little hard. So everyone says you have to get PC to stream. It could take up to about five minutes just to load up into a game. I think playing Apex on PC would probably make me a better player because I feel like the controller's holding me back. Here's my controller for my current setup. Um, I bought it used at a cheap price. Um, it still works pretty well, but these analog sticks have stick drift. And if you press down it too much, it weakens the input. So you can be mid game and you can instantly turn left for no exact reason. And this is my gaming headset. As you can see, it's a little broken, just a little bit. You have to constantly put it on right before you put it on, or else if you move too much, it could really slip off easily. One of the ways my PS4 is currently holding me back, um, there would be times where I would try to load into Apex, get into a game, the PS4 crashes, and it says system error totally deletes the entire game. Some of the gameplays that I've lost have been a detrimental uh, impact. Some of them were actually really good. Right after a good gameplay, if I feel it's good enough and I have to press this button and it says share replay. So I have to kind of let it sit for a while and let the video kind of render and then I can finally download it on my flash drive, upload it to my computer and edit it there. But with a new PC and more storage, I can just go back to back to back gaming, back to back recording, and it can go on from there. With David away, our team had all the time in the world to play. Keeping his gaming preferences and content creation processes in mind, our team set out to give him the battle station he deserves, with a couple extra special upgrades courtesy of Samsung SSD. We gutted his room and started from scratch with a brand new desk as the base of operations. Say goodbye to the monitor on a bar stool. Our team mounted two 27-inch Samsung Odyssey G52A monitors to maximize his space while giving him a serious monitor overhaul. These IPS gaming monitors feature HDR, G-Sync compatibility, and 165Hz refresh rate to help David catch his enemies off guard in the heat of battle. Why settle for two screens? We also got David set up with a Samsung Galaxy Tab S7 FE to assist with his content creation and keep tabs on chat when he's streaming. We even replaced his tattered office chair for a fancy new gaming chair. Let's get to the most important part of the build, a brand new PC, complete with the latest and greatest in PC hardware. 
And of course, the cherry on the top of a new build, the brand new Samsung 990 Pro Gen 4 NVMe SSD that offers players the ultimate gaming experience. The 990 Pro offers smart thermal controls thanks to Samsung's own nickel-coated high-end controller that delivers effective thermal control and prevents sudden performance drops due to overheating, keeping your build safe in the heat of battle. With the Battle Station overhaul complete, it's time for the big reveal. All right, take a look. Whoa, damn. I was not expecting this, holy moly. Man, this is like a professional streamer setup. You guys did this all in one day. Look at this huge table, oh my goodness. This exceeds my expectations, honestly, like so much. Whoa, they're really comfortable. Oh my gosh. I feel extremely grateful and overwhelmed and surprised, honestly, truly. I feel like a, like a CEO or something. So my first experience on PC has been pretty surreal, honestly. Uh, last night I booted it up and I started to download some games. Thanks to the Samsung 990 Pro, I'm able to load into games really quick and keep the momentum that I have for my previous game to go into the next. I think the loading times really improve my confidence to keep going and try to get the best gameplay that I have. I'm able to feel safe about hitting record, recording my gameplay, and having it saved to my files all while keeping my momentum in my gameplay. So with my new higher uh, frame rate and my faster loading times, I definitely feel like it's gonna improve my gameplay because I'm gonna be able to see people quicker and have more clarity on their movement. Thank you iGen and Samsung SSD for overhauling my battle station. Wow, I'm not gonna lie, I'm a little jealous. Congrats on the new battle station, David, and a huge shout out to Samsung SSD for helping us pull off this serious upgrade. For more on all things tech and gaming, stay tuned to IGN.com.